Hello! Welcome back to another episode of our first playthrough of Satisfactory. It's been a day um, since I've been in the game, but what I did, first of all, was I added another biofuel reactor onto the system, and then I built two more that are hooked up to this pole, but they're not on the system. I really, and I First, I really, really, really want to work on getting to coal power today. Second of all, I went and um, gathered more leaves and wood to start producing more biofuel. As you can see, the machine's running. Third, I added those reactors, the biofuel reactors, because I had a power shutdown when I did some of the rearranging that I did. Um, so let's go up here first. We'll start up here. I split the screw line up so that, remember how last episode I had said that uh, we weren't getting maximum efficiency out of the screws and stuff over here. Um, we're okay on the ore. But we weren't getting maximum maximum efficiency. So now we have three machines producing screws. And then those screws are going over here to make the rotors. And we're slowly gathering rotors. What I didn't do was split this up for maximum efficiency because going into the rotor machine, the rotor machine takes 20 per minute iron bars but if you watch our belt, we're keeping up with the iron bar production going into the machine. So producing more iron bars to have a merge into this belt to get us no further production, I think, is, is pointless. Now, maybe if I increase rotor production, instead of there being a space, it will be solid. But I don't know that to get five more bars per minute into the machine, I don't know that that was necessary. I, oh, I also did the same thing for these screws. And I also tried to increase the production of metal plates. Now, you see that it's still doing, on occasion, two, but then it's doing four. Two, then four, instead of just doing two, 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 two. So we've increased it a little bit, which is fine, which is what it is for now. There's really nothing I can do to get more plates made. I also, over here, switched things around so that this machine that was just smelting copper and not doing anything with it was now set, the one sending the bars into here to be turned into wire. While this machine is now coming over here and producing the copper sheets that we're not using yet, but we will use them, and so we might as well be producing them. It occurred to me that I did a horrible job explaining the awesome sink and the awesome shop. So the awesome sink gives you these tickets. We've worked up to nine so far. Um, each item that you, each type of item that you put in here gives you a point value. The point values accumulate. They count down when they get to zero they give you another ticket and then they start counting again. But each ticket that gets made 
with each ticket that gets made, the number of points to get to the next ticket increases drastically. Um, and so then you go into the awesome shop and you can buy f organizational things, uh, street lights, catwalks, stairs, ladders, different kinds of walls, which we're going to get because that's going to help organization getting the walls with the conveyor cutouts. Uh, wall attachments for electricity, hyper tube wall attachments, conveyor wall mounts, different foundations. These foundations are the ramps, and these are also what we're going to get because they will make it easier to place ramps. We're probably actually going to wind up buying everything. Vehicles, we're going to get this cart. Statues, these are just decorative statues. The beacon we're going to unlock. I don't know if we unlock these walls, so we're going to have to see how it plays out. The coffee cup is just decorative, but I, and I will probably buy it because I want to buy everything, uh, but that's not a priority. And then we can also buy spare parts if we need them to get something done. So for a ticket, we can get 100 copper sheets. For four tickets, we can get 50 modular frames. For three tickets, we can get 100 reinforced iron plates, etc., etc. So that's how that works. One more thing about this. So I said that I built this. That way, let's say I have something in my inventory like iron ore. Or let me see if I can find something that may... Or copper sheets. Put the copper sheets in there. Put the iron ore in there. And you will see that it just adds it all. I don't even know if the iron ore gives points. I was just using it. And now the line is filling up. The gaps between the wire is filling up with iron ore. That's the whole purpose of the awesome sink and then the awesome shop you print the tickets and you buy things in the awesome shop um while i was out gathering resources and all that i happened upon going this way about six more iron nodes um a limestone node, a copper node, and I just now, I don't, I've run past this two or three times, just now realize that there's a sulfur node here. So that's interesting. Um, so now, anyhow, on to what we need to try to get done today. Which is going to be coal production. Let's go look and see what we need. For the coal production. At some point, I'm going to tear down and reconstruct all of this. I'd love to have everything coming in from outside in one direction and then going to the different levels to build. Um, what I'm thinking about doing, I know I'm being, I'm getting sidetracked. I need to look into who has storage organization and how are they working it out what I would love to do is take the um, ceilings out in a row say right here put the walls up that have the conveyor holes in them put elevators up to those and conveyors to those walls and then put a whole row like the entire length of the building of storage and just line up all of the storage in one place so we can run down one long strip of stuff and get what we need but that may have to be down the road once we get all of the production figured out um so now back to task at hand which is going to be production of various things coal being foremost let's look in the ma'am first 
The analysis of overclock production is completed. Please choose a new mode, a new node in the tree to begin new analysis. So, we can now overclock things. Alien organisms. I need three of... Are those just the... I think I have those. A rebar gun is something that I'm very interested in. Expanded tool belt. One plus one hand slot. That's also something that I'm interested in. We need five alien carapaces. Carapai. Spiked rebars. So we get the gun before we can build the rebar? That's kind of expensive. Twenty-five rotors? Let's make how many rebar? Anyhow, I don't know. Anyhow, let's uh We'll worry about research in a minute. Let's see what we need to do to get on this coal gig. So 150 reinforced plates, 50 rotors, and 300 cable. And that will let us search for coal. The vehicular transport I'm also interested in, but we need to set up the modular frame construction, which actually I have a plan for. And then the steel production is next after that. So what... Oh, we're not going to be able to see it. I wanted to know what we needed to uh, make those pipes. So we need 150 plates and 50 rotors. And then a couple of stacks of wire so that we have extra in our inventory. How are we looking on those 150 plates? We have 200. Do I have any in my inventory? I have five, so... We'll have to take that. 50 rotors. And I'm going to go get a stack of wire also. Uh, so that we have it. Wire is... Oh. I didn't realize... I should have realized. I didn't realize those belts were crossing. That's not acceptable. I keep saying wire. I need cable, not wire. We'll take a stack of cable. And we should be able to launch that rocket and get in the groove for coal. I'd love Mark II miners, but who knows when those are going to come. Coal power. As usual, we have to watch the rocket leave. Milestone wave. reached. Coal is an improved alternative power source to biomass and can be fully automated if provided water with the new pipeline buildings and power throughout the initial setup. Coal has been added to the resource scanner. Note, ensure the close proximity of water to the coal production line. Note, pumps will aid in vertical transport of fluids through pipes. Note, Throughput and volume indicators are added to each pipe section automatically. Okay. Just wanted to make sure she was done. So, a couple of things. Before we move further, 
I need to uh, figure out where pipes are in so water extractor Coal generator. Oh, there they are. I didn't scroll down enough. So, that's all copper sheeting. So, no wonder, or I'm glad I was making the copper sheeting, because that's going to be important. And rotors are going to be important, too. Okay. Um, so, for... The coal generator, right now we can only make two of those. Mm. So we are in no way ready. For that, I think we, um, what is it to make? I'm sort of perplexed here. Because I don't know. I don't know where to go from here. Uh, we don't have enough resources made right now to set up coal power. We're making what we need to set up coal power, but we don't have what we need to set up coal power yet. Um... So, question then becomes, what, uh, no, I have a ton of those. I don't have a ton of those. I'm going to get rid of that sulfur. So I think we... I think we go look for coal. I think we go look for coal. I think we at least run power poles out to the coal. That way we can give the plates and the rotors time to catch up. Is everything working? Yeah, okay, you're making. All right, I think we start right here. Uh, coal. Wow. Oh, wait, a million miles that way. Wow. 
Wow, it's all so far away. So the closest coal is that way. Sort of straight out from the gas cloud. And that's actually beneficial. Oop, I didn't mean to jump that far. Oops. All right. So it's beneficial in that I run a power pole through here? No. It's beneficial because it's going to take us very close to um, it's going to take us very close to uh, trying to say oh it's going to take us very close to where the limestone over here is will it turn red when it's too long I'm going to say no, it won't. Or will it? Is that going to let me build that here? What? Okay. I mean, I can't be mad at that. And it's hooked to the grid? Yep. All right. So here's the limestone node right here. There's a slug right there. Which means it's probably guarded by something that's not going to be nice to us. Oh, yeah, one of these puppies. Well, that wasn't quite as smooth as I had hoped. Hello, slug. Can I take you? Thanks. So, Cole, where are you from here? In that direction. I don't like that I'm doing this at night. Not because I'm afraid of anything, but because I can't see. Okay, I see it on the other side of that tree, so... Is it going to be up high? Is that it right there? How do I get up there? I hear another one. Oh, there you are. Come on, buddy. Get her done. There we go. Well done, buddy. 
Uh, yeah, I'm. I am really not sure about this one. Guess we build up, huh? Oh god, there's eight of them. We really aren't doing well here. I hear you. There you are. Yeah, rip us. <laughs> I'll press right mouse button to respond. Rip us. So, just out of curiosity. No, that's not what I want. Sorry. Save scum it is. Where's your, uh, right there. Okay. So I don't think I have anything to eat on me. Which in itself sucks. And I think I need to build up. Maybe from there to there? I see you down there. Uh, hmm. All right. You know what? First of all, I just learned that trick that I can put stuff in a hot bar. It's not going to help me with the ramp, though, that trick. I mean, it could, and I could, but I don't want to fill my hotbar with building parts, you know? Oh, what's up, big boy? Okay. 
We're not respawning. We're just running back over here. And I'm going to heal up. I'm going to get some food. Okay. So, even though you respawn... You don't, um... You don't get your health back. Oh, and it marks your crate on the map. I didn't know that. goods so needless to say I am not much of a combat specialist I think we all picked up on that though not much of a combat specialist at all That's what exploration is all about, right? Learning what you are and are not good at. Oh, there's our bridge. Look at that. Is he dumb? Can we bait him? Oh, he can't build anything. Alright, where's our box of goods? Crate. Buddy, yeah, now what? Come on, ah, don't like getting punched in the mouth, do you? Don't like getting punched in the mouth at all. Ah, you almost fooled me. Oh, you got me. Holy shit, you pack a punch. No, I don't. What is going on? No, stop. I don't know what just happened. Other than me dying again. Why am I so bad at this? Like, clearly that is not a normal one. That's like an extra special giant one, right?
Alright, I'm done playing with that guy. I just want coal. That's all I want. Is that too much to ask? Unfortunately, this coal is not near any water. That I could... Oh my god, here comes another one. I need that other thing. The baton thing. Alright, homeboy. How many zaps does this thing take? Good lord! This is like the king of the monsters. Man, you were a pain in the butt, dude. What? You were supposed to disappear. Okay. Now the slug first. Oh, we need this guy, too, for research, I think. Oh, my God. Y'all both can both go to hell right now. Enjoy life on the other side, fellas. This is pure coal. And that's one hell of a cliff. So here we have coal and no water. Things. 
Why is everything trying to kill me here? Why? Raw quartz. We're going to take some of this because that leads us to more research. This mineral shows purity levels akin to synthetic quartz manufactured on Earth and can be used to improve communication and exploration technologies. A new research tree can now be accessed in the MAM. Looks like... Okay. Guys are all over the place. So apparently I wasn't as clever as I thought when I thought I trapped you. No, because you left a pathway right here, you moron. Um, okay. So now we need to go look at that other coal supply. to do that way. This is where we just came from, so it's this one. Right, wait, where are we going? Show me the coal. What else is going to try to kill me today? Shall we find out? Hopper. Are you another crazy one? I'm gonna regret making this choice.
No, you are not. So, here's just something in general. When you look at, oh my god, I found a copper node. And, you, oh my god, it's pure. But it's not. The, the chunk sticking up from the top is pure. If you look at the actual node itself down here, it's normal. So that's just something to keep in mind, that when you come up with a pure node, it's... And you still have the whole node sitting on top, it, it's deceiving sometimes. Um... Okay. Right. That's the one we just left. So there's copper over there. Ah. Where's your body part? Oh, there it is. So the coal's that way some way. What's up, space giraffe? Iron or normal? Iron or normal. So we have iron here, which is good to know. Barrel nuts. Am I on the most barren planet on the face of the Earth? Why am I... Oh my god, I fell down the hole. On the face of the Earth, that didn't even make sense. Am I on the most barren planet in the galaxy? The universe? What is going on here? God, now what? Tricked me. Oh god, you're right below me. That almost ended badly for us, didn't it? Exploration is not our strong suit. I'm running because I need to stop and figure out some food situation here. What is that big thing? What is making that noise? Oh, don't tell me it's up there. It can't be up there. Ah, the bacon plant thing. We needed one of those. Oh god, no, I don't want to mess with that dude. He's trying to kill me.
Okay. So I don't have ladders. And I don't even know if I have enough concrete for this. I might. Oops, I didn't mean to do that one. My bad. You can see by how slow I'm building this that I would be terrible at Fortnite. I mean, I'd be terrible at Fortnite for a number of reasons, but... This among them. Ah, and here we go. So we have coal at the top of the world. Pure coal note. And I'm going to have to fight two of these crazy things. How'd you get up here, bro? comes his homeboy. Well, come on, homeboy. Where are you? Yep, I'll take your juicy slabs of bacon there. At least I tell myself that's what it is. It's bacon. Okay, there's water down there. Is there really only one coal node here? I thought they came in pairs, generally. I mean, apparently not, but... Oh my god, how many... What is this? This is insane. What is going on? Why am I... to die. Yep. Mm. That hurts. I need two things.
Alrighty, this is not going very well. A, because bad at games. Um, and B, just because. So we'll take that because all of the delicious vittles that I can put in my system right now are going to help. More sulfur? Yum. Oh my god, more things to kill me. I don't have time for you right now, things that want to kill me. I may have to make time for you, it looks like. No, stinky plants. More stinky plants. Plants are trying to kill me now. Oh my god, I'm gonna die again. Oh. Good lord. Just leave me be, creatures. I got myself stuck. Let's, uh, prepare for battle, right? Definitely a must chainsaw area. A dog that wants to kill me. Now, several things. First off, there's a slug right here. That I want. Second off, where's the box? Here it is. All right. I can't believe death and death are only two choices. 
hole. So... Let's, uh, just for the moment, build something that we can, no, I'm not doing that, we're, uh, It's going to take a lot of clearing out up here. I um Oh, not enough space in inventory. Valid point. Let's, uh... Let's, uh, put that in there. that that for a minute um. And that killed the power. Oh, I'll bet the... No, I bet that was coincidence. I'll bet the power died because it ran out. That's fine. Um, Where's the hub?
I said which way's the hub. It's uh the direction of that big giant thing coming out of the sky, bro. I don't have time for your shit right now. Oh, son of a bitch. Well, I have it. Run, 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 run. Nope. Couldn't do it. I hate those things. There's my box. Wires too long for that one, huh? Okay, um... That's trees. So I want to put this guy up here in the corner. And 
that sh should bring us the power to run the um, thing. You know, the thing. The drill. We found coal, but no water. And then the power died. Which is why we need to get on power ASAP. Can I make the jump? Ah, yes. All right. You're at 67. Who died? Who died here? You died. Uh, you know what? You got some. You got some. And that's completely my fault. I ran off and was getting killed and ignoring what I needed to be doing. Which was making sure that power stayed up so we can build the things that we need to build to keep going. guy this guy that guy and that guy now let's throw the switch and see where we stand Okay. So our capacity is 220 and we're at about 100 and production looking. We're still producing. Uh, we're going to keep producing for a couple minutes. Alright. That's good. Alright, let's do something productive this episode since we haven't yet. Let's see what we need to progress now. Twenty five modular frames, seventy five modular frames, and fifty more, hundred and fifty more rotors. Okay. So I'm going to end this episode right here. It's going long. I'm going to have to actually do some real editing. Um, and we will come back next episode and we will start the modular frame production. And maybe between episodes, I will go look for a water source so that we can start getting some coal production online. Uh, anyhow, I'd like to thank everybody for watching. And once again, I hope you all have a great week.